Nick Fury is the leader of S.H.I.E.L.D., so clearly he's going to be able to authorize a team attack. Before anybody's laying down cards, you're going to call out that you want a coordinated team attack. Every single hero must only play one attack card for that offensive. Imagine there's six people playing. Two of them are Hydra. One person has been knocked out, but you don't know for sure if they're Hydra or S.H.I.E.L.D. If you're S.H.I.E.L.D., the reason you'd use this power at this time is the Hydra members will likely play a red card, and then once you combine everything and flip them over, if there's two red cards in the mix, it's likely that there's two Hydra members still in the mission. You can pretty much guarantee that that person that you knocked out is a S.H.I.E.L.D. member. But if you're Hydra and you use this power, you might want to throw a blue card when you use it. What that does, it'll solidify paranoia that the person that's out is a Hydra member when actually the person out is a S.H.I.E.L.D. member. If you're stuck on a really difficult villain, I recommend using this power as S.H.I.E.L.D. The reason is, sometimes Hydra members will play blues so that they don't get outed as Hydra members, so you can get out of a tough villain because everybody's going to be playing blues. So only use this power when somebody's out or if you really need to defeat a villain.